Hi guys, so I am back with another Dermacol video. I already did one and I will link it down below and I uh, I tested the shade 208 which is a really 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 light shade. So now I have a fresh tan and I'm going to test out the shade 221. I originally wanted to get the shade 218 because that's what everyone else seemed to be getting that was kind of similar to my um, skin tone. But... They didn't have any. I actually picked up mine in store. Um, and so, yeah. I'm going to be trying two, 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 one. It didn't look like it was too dark. So, I'm going to give it a go. Alright, so. Mm -hmm. I'm scared. This is going to be so, so, so dark. Oh, see, it matches my neck. But I don't know if it's like too orange. So I feel like there's nothing a little concealer can't help. Thankfully. I mean it matches my neck so it's like, you know, it works there. But... Now that I've like had the other one for a while and I've you know gotten used to using it definitely my biggest tip is don't put too much on because it will you'll feel it during the day for sure okay so I finished putting all of that on um from my end it doesn't look too bad it could literally look like a carrot on camera so I'm just gonna go ahead and do the rest of my makeup and see how that goes. So yeah, I'll be back in a second. Okay, so I'm back now. I've done my whole makeup and it's actually been um, a little while because I had dinner, my battery died and all that fun stuff. Um, so yeah, overall, I think two, what is it? Overall, the 21, no, 22 one shade was a really good match for me. Um, for reference, I use either the Bondi Sands Dark or the Bondi Sands Liquid Gold. So like it's not that extravagant of like a massive difference. It's still nice and yellow toned and yeah, I really like it. I really am enjoying this foundation. It's not like too cakey. It seems to last so nicely. Like it doesn't patch off or anything like that. So I've really enjoyed wearing this foundation in the lighter shade. So hopefully it stays the same what it should in the darker shade. But yeah, I think it's a really good match. I definitely think that a shade darker would be way too dark for me. Um, so I'm happy with this one. I hope you enjoyed this somewhat shorter video, but I thought I would just put it out there anyway because a lot of people reached out to me on Instagram and asked if I could do a darker version for when I was tanned. Um, so yeah, I hope you enjoyed this video and thank you so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye!